All right, this is site 17 at French Quarter RV Resort. And you can see it's a little loud. <laughs> um, we are right by the freeway. We are at, like downtown. You can walk to everything here. Um, these are gigantic sites. So this is a full hookup site. I'm gonna walk to the side of it. And it's very level. So we've got our sewer, our water. There is cable here as well. And then housed in the electrical box, there is both 50 and 30 amp. Coming back around here, so we're against a wall and then the freeway is right there. There's a drainage ditch here. There's actually really good drainage in the park. We got absolutely hammered by a storm yesterday and there was no flooding issue really here. So we are in the corner of the park. It is a circular kind of drive around the park here. There's 51 spots total. There's a big billboard with the Powerball numbers on it in the middle. And then you can see the city just beyond us. And if we were to walk straight about a mile, you're in the like center of it all. You're at Bourbon Street and everything like that. So each spot, there's no uh, picnic tables or fire rings with the exception of a couple of the spots that are upgraded and have like a gazebo. The um, spots all have a like lamp post, kind of every other spot, so it's well lit at night. It's great to walk through here with your dog or whatever. This is site 37, and it's one of the deluxe spots, I guess you would call it. It does come with its own patio furniture and has a little bit of privacy there. This is 29, and it's a gazebo site, and you can see there's also patio furniture in the gazebo. So sites 30 and 31 here, along with I think like I don't know, 32. <laughs> they have um, extended gazebos, a little bit larger. And then site 33 here has a gazebo with like a bar area. I'll walk into it. And it looks like there's a grill in here and then like another kind of room in the back. So this site would be awesome for entertaining. There, there's a grill, there's a sink. It looks like another grill. Um, I don't know what's going on in here. There's a fan, nice big spot to hang out. Bo here has like a little bar area added outside as well as patio tables on the inside. This is the pool area and there's a pool and a spa plus lots of seating, some sun chairs, uh, patio tables. There's a bar area there in the back and the Wi-Fi works really well here. And there's also restrooms here. Now the pool goes from four feet to six feet and there's a little waterfall there from the spa into the pool. And the spa here has a bench around the edges so everyone can kind of sit and take a nice dip. And the restrooms have a large sink, toilet, and then a shower here. Go into the shower stall. Very large shower stall. And there's the shower head right there. Also near the pool is a laundry room. There are three washers and three dryers, plus a folding table and a sink. There is a TV in here as well. And the dryers are starting at 250, and then the washers start at I think like 325 and they do take credit cards. And this park has a complimentary ice machine. This is site 38, and it actually has its own covered patio section with tables and chairs and like a little bar top area. So rounding out here, coming back around the corner to our site, there is a small dog walk area that does have a garbage and bags available right across from our site. And then some of these corner sites are huge. There's a lot of parking areas to them or recreation area to them, like this site on the corner, number 14. And now we're rounding out to our site. And the noise is a little loud, obviously, but um, my husband and I, we lived in the city for a very long time. And it's actually kind of soothing to us, but um, I don't think it's anything that's like super distracting and we definitely could sleep just fine. Here's that storm I was talking about. And this was the noisiest that it caught. 